Jamie Carragher believes Liverpool stars Harvey Elliott and Dominic Sobaslai can fill the void left by Mo Salah this month, although his hopes for the Hungarian may already be scuppered. Salah will now join up with the Egyptian squad for the African Cup of Nations, meaning he could potentially miss eight club games depending on how far his country goes in the tournament. And as a reminder of how much he will be missed by the Reds, he signed off from Anfield with two goals in the 4-2 triumph over Newcastle on New Year's Day. But, it may not just be Salah who Jurgen Klopp has to deal with out in the coming weeks. Just after the hour mark. So Barsley was replaced by Ryan Gravenberch, with the midfielder clearly clutching his right hamstring as he made his way to the sidelines. Immediately after the game, Klopp appeared in the dark over the extent of the damage to his £60 million summer signing. Referring to the frenzied fixture schedule, he said, Dominic so Barsley with a hamstring, we hope not too serious. Other players felt it as well. It's super intense. But there's no alternative if you want to win football games. Should the 23-year-old escape unscathed though? Has been backed by Carragher to fulfil Salah's wide forward role, with Elliot also backed. It will be very interesting. To see who he puts in that position, he told Sky Sports. An option could be Harvey Elliott. I think he is more of a midfield player. He lacks pace to play in the front three, but he could do it. But also so Barsley. Liverpool have got a lot of midfield options now with Alexis McAllister back, so Barsley has played in that position for his former club. The former club defender did concede, however. That replicating Salah's strike rate would be nigh on impossible. You can replace his Salah's goals, he added. That will be very difficult. The 31-year-old has struck 18 times in all competitions for the Reds this season. That's nine more than the next best Liverpool player, Diogo Hotter, while the two stars touted by Carragher have just five goals between them. Klopp's side do not play again in the Premier League until January 21. Prior to that though, they go to Arsenal in the FA Cup on Sunday. Three days before the home leg of their League Cup semi-final tie with Fulham. Privacy Notice